Uh, here's a quick one for you on the enumeration. I'm going to key in x equals, and then list 1, 2, 3, comma, a, b. and C. Can X, and that's what I get in my list. Now I want to print that whole thing out and uh, also number them at the same time. There's a quick way to do it. For, uh, let's choose uh, the letters B and C. For B, and C and enumerate and the list is called X. This is what I want you to do. Print B and C. Now what the system is going to do now is the following. It's going to run through X, assign X's value 1 to C and it'll, and it'll start counting It'll start, uh, it'll initialize B with zero and then automatically increment it with each printout. So you get zero and a one, and you get one and two, and two and three, and then three and A, and then four and B, and then five and C. Like that. We can make it a little bit nicer by putting in uh, a comma and uh, period in the space. Like that. Alright. Let's see what happens now. So, one, two, three, four, five items. And here they are. One, two, three, A, B, C. That's what we have here in our list. Well, the problem with this is it's a little bit of extra space there. Let's fix that now. We'll key in. Take B and convert it to a string. And then we'll concatenate it with a period. And I'll put a space after. And then C. A comma and C. Well, that should do it. Make it look a little bit nicer. And indeed, that does look a little bit nicer. This is George Wolf. Thanks for listening. Uh, please rate the video, and I wish you a lot of luck. Bye-bye now.